fucking Ruthie. I come into the Riverside to get a cup of coffee, right? I sit down at table, Grace and Ruthie. I'm going to order just a cup of coffee. So Grace and Ruthie's having breakfast and they're done. Plates, crust of stuff all over. So we'll shoot the shit, talk about the game, so on. Down I sit, hi, hi. I take a piece of toast off Grace's plate and she goes, help yourself. <laughs> help myself. I should help myself to half a piece of toast. It's four slices for a quarter. I should have a nickel every time we're over at the game. I pop for coffee, cigarettes, a sweet roll, never say word. Bobby, see who wants what? Huh? A fucking roast beef sandwich? Am I right? <laughs> ah, shit. We're sitting down. How many times do I pick up the check? But no, because I never go and make a big thing out of it. It's no big thing and flaunt like, oh, this one's on me like some bust out asshole. But I naturally assume that I'm with friends and don't forget who's who when someone gets behind a half a yard or needs some help with, huh? Some fucking rent or drops enormous piles of money at the track or someone's sick or something. Only, and I tell you this, Don, only, and I'm not, I don't think, casting anything on anyone. From the mouth of a southern bull dyke asshole ingrate of a vicious nowhere cunt can this trash come. And I take nothing back. And I know you're close with them. I have always treated everybody more than fair and never gone around complaining. Is this true, Don? Someone is against me. That's their problem. I can look out for myself, and I don't gotta fuck around behind somebody's back. I don't like the way they're treating me, or pray some brick safe falls and hits them on the head or walking down the street. But to have that shithead turn in one breath, every fucking sweet roll I ever ate with them into ground glass, I'm wondering where they're eating it and thinking, this guy's an idiot to blow a fucking quarter on his friends. No, I am sorry, Don. This hurts me. This hurts me in a way I don't know what the fuck to do fucking joint. They harbor assholes in there. Cunt had to win $200, and she is not a good card player, Don. She is a mooch, and she is a locksmith, and she plays like a woman. Fletcher, he's a card player. I'll give him that. But Ruthie, I mean, you see how she fucking plays, and always with that cunt on her shoulder. You see what I'm talking about? Everyone's sitting at the table, and Grace, she's gonna walk around, fetch an ashtray, go for coffee, this... And everyone's all, they aren't going to hide their hands. And they're going to make a show how they don't hunch over and like that. I don't give a shit. I say the broads are fucking partner. She walks in back of me. I'm going to hide my hand. And I say anybody doesn't's out of their mind. I mean, we're talking about money, for Christ's sake, huh? We're talking about cards. And yeah, 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 I know. I lost a bundle at the game and blah, blah, blah. But all I ever ask, and I would say this to her face, is only she remembers who is who and not to go around with her or Gracie Eater with this attitude. The past is past and this is now and so fuck you. You see? So what's new? <sighs>